वेलकम स्टूडेंट्स लेट अस सी अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग एंड इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम द चैप्टर मैथमेटिकल इंडक्शन हेयर क्वेश्चन इज प्रूव बाय द प्रिंसिपल ऑफ मैथमेटिकल इंडक्शन फॉर ऑल एन बिलोंगिंग टू द सेट ऑफ नेचुरल नंबर कैपिटल एन ओके एंड द स्टेटमेंट हेयर इज वन इंटू टू प्लस टू इंटू टू स्क्वायर प्लस थ्री इंटू टू क्यूब प्लस अप टू एन इंटू टू टू दावर एन इज इक्वल टू एन माइनस वन इंटू टू टू दावर एन प्लस वन प्लस टू इन लेफ्ट हैंड साइड यू सी देर आर टोटल एन नंबर ऑफ टर्म्स ओके एंड वी विल प्रूव इट बाय द प्रिंसिपल ऑफ मैथमेटिकल इंडक्शन सो दिस इज द मैथमेटिकल स्टेटमेंट विच इज डिनोटेड बाई पी एन सो लेट अस सी द सोल्यूशन हेयर हेयर गिवन मैथमेटिकल स्टेटमेंट इज वन इंटू टू प्लस टू इंटू टू स्क्वायर प्लस थ्री इंटू टू क्यूब प्लस अप टू एन इंटू टू टू दावर एन इज इक्वल टू राइट हैंड साइड इज एन माइनस वन इंटू टू टू दावर एन प्लस वन प्लस टू लेट अस कॉल इट रिलेशन नंबर वन ओके एंड यू नो द प्रिंसिपल ऑफ मैथमेटिकल इंडक्शन वी हैव टू टेक थ्री स्टेप्स फर्स्ट स्टेप you have to show that p1 is true means we will put n is equal to 1 here in this relation and we will show that this is true second step uh we have to suppose we have to assume that pr is true pr how we will get that we will get by putting n is equal to r here we have to show that lhs is equal to we have to assume that this statement is true for n is equal to r and third and last step we have to show that p r plus 1 is true when we will put n is equal to r plus 1 we will get p r plus 1 and we have to prove that this is correct this is true so these are only three steps and after that doing all these three steps we have to write one line statement there at the last that this uh, statement p n is true for all n okay so let us see uh, how we will start here so first step is to show that p1 is true to show that p1 is true correct and how we'll get p1 as i told you by putting n is equal to 1 here in relation number 1 so putting n is equal to 1 in relation number 1 correct so we will get here p1 and uh, you have to take here that when we will put n is equal to 1 you have to take only one term here since your total number of terms in left hand side is n but when n is equal to 1 it means we have to take only first term so here first term is 1 into 2 and right hand side will be 1 minus 1 putting n is equal to 1 here into 2 to the power 1 plus 1 plus 2 or 1 into 2 is 2 and in right hand side this is 0 so 0 into 2 square is 0 plus 2 means 2 so therefore we are getting here lhs is equal to rhs it means that is p1 is true this is correct now second step we have to assume that pr is true assuming assuming pr is true and how we get pr by putting n is equal to r in relation number 1 here total number of terms in left hand side will be r okay so now putting n is equal to r in relation number 1 we'll get pr will be 1 into 2 plus 2 into 2 square plus 3 into 2 cube plus up to n is equal to r so r into 2 to the power r and this is equal to this is r minus 1 2 to the power r plus 1 plus 2 this is relation number 2 this is second step here we are assuming pr is true okay 
third and last step we have to show that p r plus 1 is true. So, now we have to show that p r plus 1 is true and we get p r plus 1 by putting n is equal to r plus 1 in relation number 1. So, putting n is equal to r plus 1 in relation number 1. Okay? So, we will get here p r plus 1. Here total number of terms will be r plus 1. So, if you put n is equal to r here, total number of terms is r and after that we have to take one more term where there will be n is equal to r plus 1. So, your left hand side is 1 into 2 plus 2 into 2 square plus 3 into 2 cube plus r into 2 to the power r. This is rth term. We have to take one more term where we will put n is equal to r plus 1. So, this is r plus 1 into 2 to the power r plus 1. This is left hand side and right hand side is in place of n we will put r plus 1. So, this is r plus 1 minus 1 this minus 1 into 2 to the power r plus 1 plus 1 n is r plus 1 and then plus 1 and plus 2 correct. So, you see here this is how much this is plus 1 minus 1 is cancel out. So, this is r 2 r plus 2 and plus 2 correct. So, we have to establish it we have to prove it. So, here left hand side we are starting with left hand side left hand side is 1 into 2 plus 2 into 2 square plus 3 into 2 cube plus up to r into 2 to the power r plus r plus 1 into 2 to the power r plus 1 and up to this much part in relation number 2 this is r minus 1 into 2 to the power r plus 1 plus 2. So, for this much portion for this much portion we are writing its value. So, this is equal to r minus 1 into 2 to the power r plus 1 plus 2 and next term is this one next term is r plus 1 into 2 to the power r plus 1. Let us simplify it and we will try to come at this point r into 2 to the power r plus 2 plus 2 which is RHS here. Let us simplify it. Okay? So, in these two terms you see 2 to the power r plus 1 is common. So, we will take 2 to the power r plus 1 is common and here this is r minus 1 and this is r plus 1 and common is 2 to the power r plus 1 and this term is 2. Here minus 1 plus 1 will be cancel out. So, we are getting 2 into r r plus r 2 r plus 2 to the power r plus 1 and then plus 2 and this is equal to here 2 to the power r plus 1 into 2 2 to the power r plus 2 correct. So, this is r into 2 to the power r plus 2 and plus 2 this is right hand side. Here we have started with left hand side and we are coming to this right hand side. You check it. Okay. What does it show? It means that is LHS is equal to RHS and therefore, P R plus 1 is true. This is the third and last step. So, our this process is complete here. At the last we have to write one line statement here that therefore, by the principle of mathematical induction principle of mathematical 
इंडक्शन इंडक्शन पी एन इज ट्रू फोर ऑल एन सो प्रूव्ड वी गॉट द रिजल्ट हेयर दैट्स ऑल अबाउट द सॉल्यूशन ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग क्वेश्चन वी हैव टू टेक थ्री स्टेप्स फॉर प्रूविंग दिस क्वेश्चन बाई प्रिंसिपल ऑफ मैथमेटिकल इंडक्शन फर्स्ट स्टेप वी आर शोविंग दैट पी वन इज ट्रू सेकेंड स्टेप वी आर एज्यूमिंग दैट पी आर इज ट्रू एंड थर्ड स्टेप वी हैव टू शो दैट पी आर प्लस वन इज ट्रू अंडरस्टूड ओके थैंक यू वेरी मच विश यू ऑल द बेस्ट